Here, you'll see a recent hydro excess installation in the Bay Area of California. Here's how it's done. Once the location is selected, concrete pads are poured in place. A bypass line is installed around the existing control valve, including the hydro excess enclosure, which you will see being lifted here. Trenching was used to bury the conduit that connects the hydro excess to the electrical grid. The control valve is placed, followed by the turbine generator combination. With the control valve, turbine, and enclosure in place, the bypass line is then reconnected to the existing distribution pipeline. Inspection of the mechanical fittings happens and the line is pressurized. Simultaneous to the mechanical project, the electrical work is underway. The external pipes are coated with epoxy paint to the municipality's specifications. A control panel and power panel are installed on site. The hydro access is seamlessly integrated with the municipality's SCADA. The entire system can be run remotely using existing comms infrastructure. In less than six days, this hydro access system is now ready to efficiently generate clean power and protect against water loss for up to 30 years, with under 40 hours per year of scheduled maintenance. To see the full potential of InPipe Energy's hydro excess energy recovery system in your city or municipality, we will conduct a free hydraulic and potential energy assessment. Visit InPipeEnergy.com to get started today.